what homeowners always take a moment to educate homeowners about what basic electrical what maintenance example like how to change electrical what bulbs and how to reset trip or trip breakers sometimes when you break, your breaker trip and your homeowners will just call you because of what we don't educate them about how to turn on the, the trip breakers or how to what, reset a, a, a trip breakers and sometimes some people call you to come out change electrical box that one intro hello everyone welcome back to kevin electrical and electronics team here today i got something special for those of you who are there for diy enthusiastic and homeowners out there today we are driving into some essential residential electrical work whether you are electrician or someone who is taking his time for home projects so these tips will help you to ensure safety and efficiency let's get into it tip one safety safety is what non-negotiable always always ensure that you turn off all the electrical appearances before touching any electrical work an example like electrical safety gloves and electrical safety glass who always should be slipping in your safety what kits that's one is what that, that one is what tip one tip one that one is what tip one ensure that Electrical gloves and electrical or safety glass will always be what most essential thing in your, your two or your two kits. So that one is what tip one, tip one. So we are going to what tip two. The second tip on my lips is what mapping what mapping circuits. Always ensure that you know your way around what electrical or the, the residential area you are going to what going to work make sure that you know your way around there so you make sure that you map all your circuits to save you from time to save you time for troubleshooting or later so the essential that you map all your circuits before starting every car every residential or work that one is what tip what tip two so tip three is what invest in what quality tools quality tools whenever you are using quality tools is make your records Professional, you always be the your tools is what very quality and every work you do, you will make work neat and you will be what your work will be professional. So, anytime invest in what quality tools, buy appropriate tools, the tools that will help you for example, like drilling machine, the very machine that will make your work quality, will make your work neat. So, invest in what quality tools, like you have to buy quality pliers and quality what screwdriver. Sometimes, some people use. Uh, some screwdrivers, some people like it's for what? the mechanic screwdrivers, but you have to use what quality electrical what? screwdrivers that one you want to help you what to save what to make your work neat and all it's make your work professional. So that one is what tip what tip three and tip four is what clearly label what breakers or circuit breaker what bosses like if always label your circuit breakers, it's make it easy for you and your what, your homeowners. To identify this time if you are using this type of what breakers like those lighting points and what the socket and the hooker hooker like breakers so if we leave all of them clear it will make it easy for you what to look around and let's face everything so always clearly label not like and that one is what tip what tip four and tip five is what understanding what the load limits understanding the load limits of the what is a it's essential key in what electrical residential out wiring electrical residential out wiring so if we're understanding the what the load the load limits loading what circuit it's what it can be what dangerous what hazard or damage what electrical what appearances so you have to understand what the load limit is the breakers you are going to use for what, for your work so if you understand that this breaker is for the lights and this breaker is for the socket and this breaker is for the cooker that one it will help you to what to keep to make your out your work neat so always understand what your load limits
and tip six we are going to talk about it what energy what efficiency what lighting energy efficiency lighting always recommended the energy what efficiency lighting like led bulbs for what for your homeowners so that it will help them it's, it will also help them to what, save what energy electrical what, energy and the all and what the quality if you buy the energy the efficient one that one is a quality so it's always save them time and it was also what save them money so always recommend what energy efficient what lighting for your what, for your homeowners the quality thing if you buy the quality things for your money it's what it is save them money and what it will last what it will last long so always recommend energy efficiency what lighting for your for your home owners this is what educating what homeowners always take a moment to educate homeowners about what basic electrical what maintenance example like how to change electrical what box and how to reset trip or trip breakers sometimes when your your breaker trip and your homeowners what just call you because of what we don't educate them about how to turn on the the trip breakers or how to do it reset a, a, a trip breakers and sometimes some people call you to come out change electrical out box that one is not necessary sometimes homeowners can out change out their moves if you educate them about it so always be ensure that you educate homeowners about this basic electrical out maintenance that one is what save you from unnecessary what emergency calls so always educate them about this and we are going to Another one on my list, but inspection. Always take inspection whenever you are out. You've done with your work, and you have to what regularly what making inspection so that when there there is it will take uh, it will what you avoid you avoid what major what major what, major electrical what problem. Whenever you take early uh, early regular what inspection, it will it will save you from a major what electrical what problem drawn to what drawn to line so make sure that you take regular inspection like like this if you take regular inspection it save you from what major what we have to also do what preventive what preventive maintenance that one it will help you for what for for electrical it's it help you and what the house uh, home owner it will help you and what the home owner so always what take a regular what inspection and another one one on my list is what proper wire management proper wire man ensure that all wiring is what where what organized all wiring is what where what organized make sure that all your wiring is what where what organized does it make, make it what not only does it make it what look more professional but it's also called it's also helpful for what future what maintenance Make it what a breeze. What make future maintenance what a breeze. So whenever you are coming, uh, some future you are coming to replace something, it will make what find what easy. So this one is called make what future maintenance what what a breeze. And another one on my list is what emergency what preparedness. Discuss emergency procedures with homeowners. Make sure you educate them about how to turn off the power in case of what electrical what emergency. It's called what it's being called prepared. So you make sure that you educate them, you tell them how to shut off the power in case of what emergency electrical what emergency. So this is what it's called what emergency what. And the last one on my list is what stay what stay informed. Always stay what inform. Lastly, inform. Lastly, ensure that you keep what yourself updated on what latest what electrical what course or not regulation. Stay informed on what keep yourself what updated. Always keep yourself what updated on what electrical what latest what course or not regulation. Compliance is what crucial for what for your. For your professional what what and for your legality of what of legality of what of your work and there you have it folks some key tips for residential electrical work
whether you are a professional or homeowners. This tips will help you to navigate yourself for your electrical or project work safely and what efficiently. If you find this, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like, share, subscribe, and stay updated on every content I will make. This is Karen, Engineer Vincent from Karen Electrical and Electronics Engineering signing off. Karen Electrical and Electronics Engineering. Karen Solution Feature Connection. Out of nothing into something I love. I got a poker face, but honestly, I'm not one to bluff. I flip a switch, never miss, man. I always stay up. Don't let them see you, bitch. Always have a plan to stay tough. This life ahead of you ain't easy. It was built to be rough. But that's what makes a personality is tragedy, bruh. Uh, so keep your head on your shoulders. Now we ain't out here moving rocks. We out here moving.